Welcome to the county ground Letchworth for this Hertfordshire FA Intermediate Cup final between AFC Oaklands on the right of your screen in red and black and Cheshunt on the left in light blue and white. I'm Michael McCann, your commentator. So there's the Cheshire boys and then our referees and fourth official and the AFC Oakland's ads in red and black. So we're off and running the AFC Oakland's side in red and black kicking from right to left in this first half. Cheshire referee's got a real job on his hands seeing what's going on in there. In it comes. And it almost works as well. Sam Eilert's header cleared off the line. And then hooked away by Spearman. Clear tactic by FC Oakens to pack the six yard box and it almost gives final. In the 10th minute. Balls with Cheshire at the back, given away. Now Walsh clips it forward. Good ball towards Scott Cleland. Cleland takes a touch, brings it down. Pulls to Spencer Cleland. What a finish! AFC Oaklands have the lead. Spencer Cleland with a magnificent strike from distance. Plenty of power and rifled into the top corner. Absolutely nothing Aaron Ball could do about that. And it's AFC Oaklands who have the lead in this Hertfordshire FA Intermediate Cup Final with a special goal from Spencer Cleland. In comes the corner, chested down inside the six yard box. Cleland shoots off the line. Spencer Cleland nearly securing himself a first half brace in this Hertfordshire FA Intermediate Cup final. Throwing down the right. Oakland's looking for that second goal to really put them in control of this Intermediate Cup final. Cleland works it for Blake. I can hear the excitement around me, but in truth, I always thought Aaron Bull had his angles covered there. Or any foul, of course. Picked on by Blake towards goal. Falls for Cleland. Scott Cleland didn't quite get a good connection on that volley, but it dropped kindly for him. Half time not too far away. Still 1 0 to AFC Oakland. Sent forward by A lot. One for Blake to chase. Steve Weldon trying to get on to the afterwards. Fix it on for Blake. Well tackled. And the corner one. And set back for Tyler Josephs. Packs it long. Full to Spencer Cleland. Cleland looks forward to Matthew Walsh. Walsh bursts into the area, crosses it to the far post and headed just the wrong side of the goal from an AFC Oakland's viewpoint. Sit in towards the far post, cleared by Cheshunt though. Chance of a break if they can go quickly as well. Good pass around the corner into the channels. Real danger here. Still going. Cage with the shot. It's blocked, comes back for Lopez. Lopez makes it 1-1. The goalkeeper Tyler Josephs could only parry the initial shot from Cage straight into the path of Thiago Lopez. It's the substitute with the assist and the striker makes it 1-1 early in this second half. Game on. Here comes Robinson in towards the far post. Magnificent diving header and Sam Eilot scores. AFC Oakland's regain the lead just four minutes after Cheshire equalised through Lopez. It's a beautiful diving header into the far corner. Strained every sinew to get there. Undoubtedly been the better team. Long throw cleared. Danger not fully gone though. 
It's a bit scrappy. Flicked round the corner to Cleland. Cleland's shot isn't clear, lays it back. And it's a finish provided by Taylor Blake. Cleland looked like he was going to shoot, but then actually showed incredible composure to lay the ball back for Taylor Blake, who finished into the empty net with Aaron Ball out of his goal. The celebrations and pile on bundle go on in earnest. Even the keeper, Tyler Josephs, running up there to high five a few players. And the upshot is that it's AFC Oakland's free, Sheshant. One. There we go. Cheshire, the free one, loses today to AFC Oakland, so you'd have to say thoroughly deserved.